Hello everybody, Hyper Mario Sunshine here, and here is an unboxing video for the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom Switch OLED. As you can see in the front, uh, here's the story behind this. Uh, I managed to get it because I was going to give my sister my other OLED, and so she gave some money, basically to help me out, and basically to pay off for my other Switch. Not pay off, but like, you know, uh, to obtain my other Switch, so she would give me money for it. But uh, yeah, so this is the OLED uh, Legend of Zelda edition it has like a nice uh, yellow, uh, uh, not yellow, it has a nice golden, uh, like you know, outlining and whatnot, a little few symbols here and there. Uh, yeah, it's white. I wish there was like more detail rather than just like the Joy Cons. Like, I wish the backs also had some stuff on them, like some nice designs or some nice patterns. I feel like they could have gone, gone for some green on the uh, the dock as well. It's kind of like the Joy Cons, but. Yeah, it feels a little, the dock itself feels a little too similar to the regular dock, but otherwise, the Joy-Cons look really nice. The, I remember getting the uh, Joy-Cons for the uh, for Skyward Swords release, the uh, limited edition ones for that, and I still have them. And uh, yeah, let's get to unboxing. Uh, I believe this is the part that usually comes off. There we go. And I can't believe it's already been six years of the Switch. I think I might make, like, some video of it, of, like, my favorite Switch games later down the line. But here we go. There it is. There's the screen. And I'm going to be transferring all my save data over to here and also putting in my uh, SD card. Because uh, I'm not giving my sister a one terabyte SD card for free. Unless she pays me, like, $100, I don't know, to get me another one. And there is the HDMI cables. All the usual stuff. The charger it does come with. Excuse me. It does come with the Joy Con. I wish this was like stylized as well to be like it, but to be like the Joy Cons in a way. But uh, they do have the Switch Pro controller one, uh, which I am going to be getting on release day. Uh, here are the uh, Joy Con attachments. I have like a nice uh, uh, golden uh, white dotted uh, pattern going on these. I wish there were some green though. I feel like it could have used a bit of green because uh, I feel like those colors would go well over well, uh, go well overall together. And lastly, the dock itself. And okay, here we go. It has a nice sleek front. Look at that. Wow. Is there anything in the back? There are a few little, like, the, the, like little, like, patterns there, but otherwise, doesn't really have anything else. But I, I would have liked to see some greens, maybe in the back. It would have feel, feel like a, it would have definitely feel a lot better, especially uh, since the uh, Splatoon and the uh, Pokemon ones looked really, really good. But, uh, yeah, I think that is about it. And obviously, I will be uh, transferring over my data onto this and giving my Swiss sister the other OLED. But yeah, there's the unboxing video. A little bit messy, but yeah, this was uh, pretty exciting to open up, and thank you all so much for watching this uh, quick unboxing video for the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom OLED.